1914 D. Lincoln sent. Graded in Mint State 66 read by PCGS. According to Heritage Auctions, the 1914 D is one of the premier keys to the Lincoln Cent series, boasting one of the lowest mintages in the set with less than 1.2 million coins struck. In fact, this early Denver Mint issue is considerably more challenging and high grade than the more famous 1909 SVDB. Most Mint State survivors show up in MS63 and MS64 in the brown and red and brown categories. Fully red coins are much scarcer. This strongly struck premium gem features bold detail on Lincoln's hair and beard. The legends on both sides and the reverse wheat stalks are similarly razor sharp. Satiny luster glows from finely textured copper orange surfaces. It was sold for $72,000. Number 6. 1922 No D. Lincoln sent with strong reverse. Die pair 2. The obverse is a mushy mess, the Ellen Liberty pulled to the rim and the portrait under detailed, the luster of the whole a quicksilver gloss found only on the most put upon dies. The reverse, of course, is far sharper and has a distinct swirl to the underlying luster. It displays charming surface color, violet infused on both sides with a deep brown base on the obverse but distinctly redder on the reverse, which technically remains brown but is far livelier than that name might suggest. Carbon is minimal and marks are few on this remarkably well-preserved gem. It ended up selling for $82,250. Number 5. 1927 Lincoln Cent. Graded in Mint State 68 read by PCGS. This is another issue that is readily available in fully red gem condition, though the population drops rapidly above the grade of MS66 RD. While some coins will have less than full strikes, this is not a major issue with the 1927 P cent, and collectors should settle for nothing less than a sharp impression. M68 specimens are rarely encountered though. This spectacular penny fetched a sum of $84,000 at auction. Number 4. 1969 S Lincoln sent with double die obverse. Graded in Mint State 64 read by PCGS. The 1969 S double die obverse has been called the king of the Lincoln scent varieties. The variety was first recognized in mid-1970, but the discovery coins were declared counterfeit and even seized by the U.S. Secret Service. True 1969 S DDO scent displays doubling of all letterings on obverse except the mint mark. The well-preserved original red surfaces of this error penny are lustrous and appealing, despite a few small amber carbon spots on both sides. Number 3. Attractively toned proof 1909 VDB scent. This 1909 VDB Lincoln scent certified PR67 plus red and brown PCGS, with the added CAC gold label, is a legendary coin among aficionados of matte proof Lincolns. This piece truly is a joy to behold. Generous daubs of rose pink dominate the upper hair and forehead of Lincoln and a bit of the reverse around the T and scent, seeding to light sandy orange colors accented with glints of jade throughout the fields and the remainder of the devices on each side. The fine matte texture is completely pristine and unperturbed throughout, complementing the full proof strike and squared off inside rims. There is absolutely no trace of carbon, contact, or any other distraction. It was sold for $258,500. Number 2. A Wartime Error Penny. 1943 Bronze Cent. Graded as AU50 by PCGS. AU standing for about uncirculated, meaning it was very briefly circulated and shows slightest traces of wear on high points and fading of original luster. The 1943 Bronze Lincoln Cent is probably the most famous and sought after error coin of all time. The copper used for coining bronze cents was needed for the manufacture of munitions during World War II and all Lincoln cents were supposed to be struck on zinc-coated steel planchets. As fate would have it, some of the old bronze planchets remained stuck in the tote bins used to feed the coin presses at the end of 1942. When coinage began in 1943, this handful of bronze planchets became dislodged and fed into the presses, along with millions of the regular issue steel planchets, creating this mysterious mint error. This error penny ended up selling for $336,000. Number 1. 1944S Zinc Coated Steel Scent. Another famous and super valuable wartime error coin. Graded in Mint State 66 by PCGS. The 1944 Zinc Coated Steel Scents owe their creation to the dark days of World War II, when America and her allies needed strategic metals including copper and nickel for the war effort. 
The 1943 Lincoln scents were struck out of a catastrophically flawed combination of metals, namely steel coated with a thin layer of zinc. As any numismatist worth his salt knows, the zinc-coated steel scent planchets were magnetic. Not only did they develop rust and a powdery, mildewed appearance, zinc oxide, after a short time in circulation and in the presence of moisture, they also did not function in the one-cent gum vending machines prevalent at the time, which used magnets to defeat steel blanks inserted as currency. The 1944 steel scents were off-metal errors apparently created via the same mechanism as the 1943 copper scents, when a smattering of leftover blank planchets from the previous year remained in mint tote bins or hoppers as the new year turned. Although the 1943 copper scents have seen the lion's share of publicity over the years, the 1944 steel scents are nearly as rare but less well known. This error scent ended up selling for $408,000. There you have it, folks. The fascinating journey through the world of rare Lincoln scents. If you enjoyed this video and want to stay updated on all things numismatic, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell. God's will, see you in the next episode.